everyone, so it's Saturday again, and I have my hair straightened, Woo. so it's pretty and not ugly and curly and gross, but anyway, um, this week I'm going to be talking about pet peeves of mine for Facebook, because everybody has a Facebook that I know of, aside from like little kids or like 10 year olds and stuff, but you know, whatever. But some of my pet peeves for Facebook is how people will like upload a picture of themselves on Facebook and honest to goodness it's probably the hideous, hideousest whatever picture that I've ever seen in my entire life. And you know like 30 people like it and it's like wow okay so I post a really decent nice looking picture of myself on Facebook and like I get one like and that's from my mother or my grandmother or something. And then one of the popular girls posts a picture of herself like making the weirdest face, like looking totally weird, and she gets like 50 likes. So it's like, okay, so looking bad is good, alright. So then it's like, if I try that concept and make a really weird looking picture, I get no likes, so it's even worse. So I don't even know, understand that. That doesn't make any sense to me at all. Another thing I don't like about Facebook is how, like, the new, new timeline setup thing. I mean, I like the old Facebook better because it was a lot more efficient, but now, like, with timeline, it just doesn't make much sense anymore. I mean, it's like, you have, like, a cover photo, and it's, it's just weird. Like, who wants to know, like, I don't know, it's just weird. Another thing that I don't like about Facebook is all the drama. I mean, I get it. It's actually quite entertaining to watch people fight over Facebook. Like, you'll see, like, that awkward moment when your best friend is now, you know, the meanest person I've ever met in my entire life. And they'll post it on Facebook. Or, like, the awkward moment when, you know, your boyfriend decides to slap you across the face. Like, okay, thanks for informing us about your relationships and such, but I really didn't need to hear that. So, why are you posting it on Facebook? That's my logic. Another thing is that when there's drama on Facebook, usually a lot of other people get involved with it and it just makes it a big mess. So like, the drama will be, say if it's, say if it's my drama, okay? And I post something on Facebook saying, so my best friend, I just found out, is the meanest person ever and yada 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 and I hate her now. I post that on Facebook and then somebody who's not even involved in the situation at all posts a comment underneath it and it says, yeah, well, I think that you should have done this. And then another person posts, I think you should have done this. And another person posts. So it's like, becomes everybody's drama all of a sudden. And then it gets worse because somebody who's not even involved with the drama will say something. And then another person will be like, uh, WTF, why are you getting involved with my drama? And it's like, uh, you post it on Facebook and it's just, it's stupid. Why, why do you have to involve yourself with dumb drama that doesn't bother anybody aside from you and the person you're involving with? Another thing that I don't like about Facebook is how, like, there's so many, like, like this photo if you brush your teeth. Okay? I brush my teeth, but I'm not going to clutter my page by saying, oh, I like this because I brushed my teeth. It doesn't make any sense to me. Or, like, the ones that say, like my status if you think I'm cool. Or... Like my status if you agree with me. And there's like a picture of something that says an awkward moment when and fill in the blank. Like those kind of things. I like them because some of them are funny. Like some of them are legit funny. Some of them just like, wow, that's great. Whoever posted on Facebook is a smart cookie because they thought of that. But then it's like, this is really stupid. Why are you posting on Facebook? It doesn't make any sense. And you're cluttering my newsfeed, so thanks for that. Doesn't make any sense at all. Well, today's Saturday, and it's been about four and a half minutes now. Got my hair straightened. I'm going to go to graduation parties and a quinceanera. And for those of you who don't know what a quinceanera is, is when Mexican girls turn 15. It's their becoming of age party. And they become a woman, basically. 
and my friend is having one, and there's going to be a chocolate fountain there, so be jealous, okay? Chocolate fountains are the best, and I'm going to have one, so for all you people who watch this video, be jealous. Oh, and I apologize for not making a video last week, and I think my cat just walked in here. Yeah, my cat just walked in here. For those of you who don't know, that's my cat Peyton. Peyton! Peyton! So my cat's in here now, just so you know. But yeah, so have a good day, y'all, and I'll see you next week and possibly the middle of the week if I make another video.